the idea is not just to buy the cheapest course you can. You want to buy a good course. And a lot of times what you're paying is not for the course, but you're paying for the full package, full presentation. So Luke, great question. Have you dug into Coder Foundry course yet? Any reviews? Thoughts or first impressions? So Luke, I did buy the course. Here's the thing though. This is a pre-order. This is like pre-purchase before the course comes out. So the course is technically not out. So there's not any coding material there. They're just trying to get initial kind of the people that supported their channel. They want to give them a good deal. And so they're kind of doing this kind of like a Kickstarter idea. Now, the course is there. They're going to put out the content for sure. But they're giving you the best deal possible, which is $129 for the whole year. So I bought it and I bought it with the intent because I do ASP.NET development. So I think it's going to be a good supplementary way for me to study as I'm working. And what I like about them is they have a very structured curriculum. So I don't have to try to piece things together. It's going to be one path from the basics all the way to becoming a full stack ASP.NET developer. Is this for everybody? You guys have to make that decision. I can't tell you go buy it now or don't go buy it. In my case for $129, it made sense to me because what I don't have to do is I don't have to scour the web and try to find tutorials and any of you guys who you know if you're a react developer there's plenty plenty of tutorials and free stuff that you could find that is good I mean if you find you will find good stuff eventually you have to look for it and you spend time looking for stuff but that's besides the point but for C sharp stuff there's not that many great courses even on Udemy even then um, you know it's hard to find maybe I found two or three out of the hundreds that they have there and I'm kind of sick and tired of constantly looking for courses starting them and then being like oh this is not that good this is not that good so yes I'm taking a chance for $129 but I know that they're gonna raise the price to $99 a month once they release the course so it's gonna be 1200 bucks a year which is already starting to add up so snag it for 129 the way I look at it it's like I'm gonna take that chance and of course I'm gonna review the lessons here and I will tell you about the course once they start releasing the content but right now they're in that pre-sale uh, portion and yes you're taking a chance but 129 dollars I guess you could for 129 dollars I'll be honest with you you could buy 10 Udemy courses so you could buy 10 Udemy courses you just got to make sure that you buy them that in a way that all those 10 courses help you construct a curriculum that you could follow to get a job in the tech stack uh, you want and yes you could do that and I've done that but I like Coder Foundry not gonna lie to you I I liked them before I even got interested in C Sharp. I really like the value they give on the YouTube channel. So I look at it, you know what? I'm going to invest in their course because from all the value I got from them on their YouTube channel. And if it's $129 that I pay and the course sucks, which I don't think it will because they're going to be teaching the same stuff they're teaching in their bootcamp. So it'll be awesome. But we could, we'll talk more about it, you guys, if you like. But that's just my opinion so far. Yes, hey, creating with code. Yes, please do a review on Code of Foundry course. By the way, greetings. Yes, I will once it's legitimately out right now like i said they're pre-selling the course they're trying to build excitement get people sign in and that's just how launch when you're launching a new course that's how things go you know when you're selling something that nobody knows about you're gonna sell it for a very ridiculous low price because you want to get people in the door you want them to have good experience and you want them to give you good reviews so that's what they're basically doing they're saying look this course is going to be twelve hundred dollars but you could spend 129 dollars right now get into the course and they're hoping on the fact that people that got in this early for a ridiculously low price will give them good reviews that will help them sell the course for what it's priced at. Now, some people will say, listen, on Udemy, I could buy a bunch of courses for $12. Yeah, you can. And go ahead, do whatever you want to do. It's not a problem. But here's the thing that you guys have to keep in mind is that when you're signing up, or buying a course the idea is not just to buy the cheapest course you can you want to buy a good course and a lot of times what you're paying is not for the course but you're paying for the full package full presentation they did their research they have a lot of experience with ASP.NET and C Sharp they have a very good curriculum that you could follow but of course you don't have to buy through them go on free code camp they actually have a really good outline curriculum and you could follow that the thing is about when I buy courses I buy courses because I know they're gonna save me time because if you have one-stop shop for the tech that you want to learn instead of going left and right and Udemy and Pluralsight or whatever you could just focus on that one bootcamp 
and from start to finish and go get the job. What I like about them also, they're going to not only teach you the programming skills, but they're also going to help you and walk you and teach you how to prepare yourselves for the interview and how to do 